All right. I'm starting a new game in one of in a game I remember quite fondly. It's Fez. Oh no, all my progress will be lost. I had like three files on this. I, I remember making the first one and trying that one out. I might have tried a couple other times to play this game again and just like never truly got back into it because I remember too much. But at this point, I've kind of completely forgotten everything. So, it's going to be good. It, it's it's, it's going to be good at this point. Can't wait until I can do that with Super Mario World. All right. We start out. Ooh, the controls is with the arrow pad. Oh. I'm not supposed to be jumping on a drum like this. What was that? Ha <laughs> ha! Behind the drum. Alright, alright. That was kind of dumb. But I wanted to do it, so shut up. <gasps> this is a tall place, isn't it? Is that guy sending mail? Am I the only place that gets mail? How did how did he send it straight to me? You know, I need to turn up my volume. I don't know if any volumes coming in through. Huh. Let's see. There we go. There's some sound coming through. Alright, now I have it a bit too loud on my end. Come on. There we go. Oh, I can fall asleep. I'm just going to sleep next to these children playing over here. How do I talk to them? Hello, children! Oh, that was... Okay. Escape doesn't do anything that I can tell. I'm just running around pressing escape now. Yeah, maybe you shouldn't have stayed up all night last night, huh? Can I... Oh! Aha! I didn't have to do the ladder. What's over here? <gasps> can I go inside? <gasps> Whoa. Oh, this is probably the guy's house. The guy that sent me mail. Nah, you had to stay up all night. Got it. He has a picture of a bird in his house. Can I get on top of the tree? No. Alright. You know what? I want to go in here. I kind of want to, I, I want to explore a bit. <gasps> what if X and Y, then square? I understand, Miss Teacher Lady. How do I talk to you? Is everyone just mute? It's a mutiny. I hate it. <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's a mutiny because they can't talk. Oh, just a little kitchen. Nothing's in here. Just kitchen stuff. Can I kick... Oh, I can't kick the plates over. Alright. Oh, it's getting dark. Should probably get to the guy. Probably wanted me here. Oh! Someone's talking to me! Left shift. Today's a special day? How so? Venture is ready. It's, to it, it, it's, it's Gomez time. Mike Gomez? Any time now. Just you wait. There you go! Hey, it's like a hexagon. 
Wait, no, it's a cube? But they were just barely theorizing about squares. How can they... Th how, how could cube exist if they theory about squares? This is really trippy. Where am I? So I've actually at one point translated what that cube's saying. He's like, oh, hello, uh, and welcome, you're, you, you look different than last time. He's like, well, uh, this is a pretty routine procedure, let's, let's just try it and get it done. I don't think anything will happen, it's just routine. I don't know exactly what he's saying, but I, I, I'm, a, from what vaguely I can remember, that's a translatable language right there. And I had it. I, I had an app I, I'd used to translate. I doubt any of those apps still work anymore. Probably find an image though. Each one of those represents a, a letter. And the letter U and the letter V is, shares the same character, so you kind of have to guess sometimes. It, 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 it's kind of easy because like context and whatnot. Whoa, where'd the statues go? Oh. <gasps> What? The. Th Whoa! Three dimensions! Ah, oh, this is too much! Alright. I think he's saying this, the, the, the process is ready to start. And he's gonna give me a thing to test out. To, to, to finish the routine procedure. Look at that, it's a little fez. Look at that cute little thing. I like it. I, I played this game around the time that I was watching Doctor Who. And and that that was what... And I, I don't remember the guy's name, but he's like, Oh, fezes are cool. I mean, obviously it was the doctor. To change my perspective. Whoa! Hey, that was pretty cool. Where, where, where can I go with this? Oh, I can't go off the platform. Uh-oh. Music's getting kinda... Or, or, or noises kinda ramping up. Uh-oh. Whoops, I broke it. Hey, look. Look, pal. You gave me the hat. I thought it was okay to move like this. Oh, jeez. I broke the game forever. All right, give me... Oh, oh, it's coming back on. I love the startup sequence. Trixel engine. Uh-oh. That's not how it's supposed to act. All right. Yeah, zooming through the through the stars. I don't feel like it zoomed through the stars as much last time. Oh, I wake from my bed. Fez on my head. Whoa. Whoa. My room has shape. Outside of the second dimension. Oh, come on, let me, let me, come on, I know I can go down from here without, okay. Well, I was just on the other side of my room. It's like some sort of crazy quick travel. Hey, what's that little buddy? Is this some sign, is it some sort of 3D fairy? Some kind of friend? Hello, friend. Oh, I am Gomez. Yes, hello. Something went wrong. I kind of assumed something went wrong when my game crashed. <gasps> he needs my help. 
and you were sent to guide me. Oh, it's Dot! I like that name. Very cute. The Hexahedron. Oh, that. so that's the thing I was talking to, was the Hexahedron, and I, I fragmented it. I mean, he told me to do what I was doing, and you can't really fault me. Scattered and shit. It was shattered and scattered all over my world. I have to restore it. Without it, everything will collapse. Alright, give me a second. I'm just vibing to this music. I absolutely freaking love this music. I've received a gift. Alright. Great secret has been revealed to me. There is a world beyond my village. There is? Dimensions beyond the ones I occupy. <gasps> what if there... What if there's a... Whoa. I don't even know what to call it. Alright. The store leads to the outside world, but for now it is sealed shut. Uh, that doesn't actually look like it leads very many places. It's, it's just at the bottom of the island. Marking on it indicates that you won't- that it won't open until you've collected at least one cube. There are many such doors in the world, each requiring more cubes than the last. To reach the end of this journey, you will need to find all 32 cubes. But first, you must leave this place. Alright, pretty standard stuff, pretty simple. There are eight cube bits in this village. Oh, it's getting dark. I forgot there was a day-night cycle in this game, and it's very pleasant. I think if I look at those constellations back there, I can, uh, and, and like, shift in the right directions, it'll give me, like, a full cube. But I don't remember how to decipher that. I'm going to have to look up how to decipher that. I'm not going to, like, look up the, the the answer completely, but I'm definitely going to look up how to decipher those. Like this one right here. That's, that's, that's a cube bit. Together, they'll form a full cube, which you can use to unseal the door. I'll find them. Okay. So, quick recap. Shiny golden cubes, very important. Gotta find them all. Or else the universe will collapse with me in it. Got it. No pressure. And remember, use DA to change your perspective. Get going. Hey! Whoa. <gasps> no one knows how I got back here. <gasps> oh, there we go! You saw Devil Square? What about you? Where did I go? Did you bring me something- some, me back something? No, I got a fez though. That's my fez. Oh, this music's amazing and I love it. But I should probably turn it down just a bit so I don't damage my ears. Now let me know if the music's too loud. Alright. Check that out. This guy doesn't even know he, he's on a two-dimensional plane. He doesn't even know how I'm talking to him right now. I'm just in a weird perspective to him. That was a cube! But that's not possible! Be wrong about that. I deal with cubes every day. Do you see this tree? Not just a square anymore. Oh, hey! This is his house. It's been so long time. It's it's your turn now. I'm tired. Plus, there's the the whole eye thing. I only have one. Y you, you you know how it is. Yeah, I guess you're right. All right, I'm gonna drink some water. That's what Mudkip says: hydrate or dehydrate. That was a cube. Whoops, whoops. I'm back! Yes, I am! 
Was I gone that long? I don't think I was gone that long. Alright, everyone's on this side. Anything on this side? <gasps> There's a house over here. I doubt anyone's been in here for a long time. I know if I do something special here, like a whole code, I can unlock something, but I don't see anything. Also, I don't like the music, the, the sounds in there, it's kind of spooky. I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna see what's in this guy's house. Another tree? Oh. This guy's got a lot of artwork on his walls. Each one of these is a picture of... I don't know, is that a penguin? And what's that, just a small man? A little dot guy? The little dot's my little companion now, but... I don't even know what to call that. The one-legged man? I think I'll just leave it be for now. Oh, whoops, I probably shouldn't have. All right, I'm gonna go in here. <gasps> but what if Z? Z axis? She drew a cube on a 2D plane. How'd you figure that out? Can it be? A new direction? Whoa. Yep, and I'm traveling that direction right now. Wait, 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 wait. She's drawn on the other walls. I doubt she even knows about this. What's with all these little creatures on the wall? Wonder how long that's been there. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, Q, R, S, T, U, V. Oh, then it starts over from A. Whoa, a digestive system. And there's the island. And there's a whole bunch of squares. Who knows what that is? And this wall just has a clock on it. Are there any more secrets in here? There used to be a map I could look at. I don't know how to access that map yet, though. To see if I've completed a room. Alright. This is a pretty neat space you've got here. I'll, I'll, I'll see y'all. Maybe when I come back and know more. Oh, it's night time again. Alright, what's in this room? Oh. One of the little cubes. I've got four. Just need four more. Ooh, another room I doubt anyone's been into. But, I found a chest. A treasure chest. To open it, face it from the front and press left control. Oh my gosh, I forgot about this. Hey, it's a key! I can go into that one room. Yeah, I found a key. Keys can be can can open any locked door, but it can only be used once. Okay. Oh, another room that no one's been in f for a long time. I didn't like the sounds in there. Uh-oh, here's another one. That guy's got a square on his face. Is he king square on my face? They really know how to make a creepy room. These people have really tall heads. Oh, another... Wait, I, just, I, I got a key from that chest. 
I'm gonna go down before I go the rest of the way up. Actually, you know what? I'll, I'll get there on my way back down. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to come back down. Oh. Yeah, I don't want to go that way. All right. Is that the full thing? Hey! My first cube! I did it! Pressing all the wrong buttons. Now I can unseal the door. Let's go! All right. Oh, I can go in here now. A map. Oh, and there's those little Tetris pieces. I found a treasure map! Yay! A map of what? To where? I don't know. Figure it out yourself. Okay. A square, if I remember correctly, is jump. I don't remember if that's... Because this is like move left or shift left. Okay, that's probably the left direction. And then that's shift left, that's shift right. And if I read around... I, I need to get a pen and paper somewhere. All right, I have a pen. Now to use a sticky note. Give me a second, I'll be right back. I'm gonna start writing notes so I can solve the puzzles. Actually, it might, what I'm looking for might be in here. Oh, sticky notes. I've been looking for those. All right, got, got sticky notes. I'm going to try to solve this puzzle early. Because I think I can, if I can remember this correctly. I'm going to write my key down on this sticky note here. So square was jump. Alright. And then the Tetris piece... Pointing left was left on the arrow pad. Tetris piece up is up. Tetris piece right should be right. Arrow pad. Oh wow, that's a lot. Oh, there's a Tetris piece down. There's a symbol next to each one. Oh, I wonder if those are numbers. Those are most definitely numbers. Alright. So Tetris piece down exists. That's... Down on the arrow pad. And then there's the Z pieces. I want to say... The one with the top going to the right and the bottom to the left... Is Shift A. Or Shift in the A direction, whichever one. This is A. And the one in the other direction... is D. All right, I got my answer key. Now to paste it somewhere I can decipher it. And to search up the Fez language on my phone. Fez language decoder.
Alright, there's a bunch of alphabet. Alright, number decoder. Found it. Alright. Blank square is zero. Two, three, four. Okay. Eight, nine, ten, five, six, seven. All right, so that instruction on the wall there is number three. Okay, five, six, seven have two different symbols on them. So I'm going to write on this sticky note a series. How, how many things are on the wall? One, two, three, four, five, six. Is that just six? Okay, I, I need to count again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's seven in all that I can count. Now, I'm going... So write these numbers and then what I'm supposed to press on each step. Four, five, six, seven. So that thing on the wall there with the line through the middle, that is number six. So that should be A. The other thing on the wall is two. So that is D. One going down. Oh, whoops, I... D is supposed to be two, not three. All right, so the T, the, the T block pointing left is instruction Three, and I got that down right now. All right. So that one right there is instruction one. The, the one on the left. It's neat they put a skull on the wall also. Oh, I might be able to translate those letters on the wall. The It's those square characters. All right. So one is press up. So up, D, left, and then two steps I haven't put in yet. Okay, the one on the right, what number is that? Five. So that's press right. All right, and what's the one coming in from the left? Four. So step four is jump. Oh, I, th I'm having so much fun right now. I forgot how much fun decoding these was. And what's that? Is that... Yep, seven. That's step seven on the wall there. All right. And then the last one is down. And if this doesn't work, then I swap A and D. All right. Here goes nothing. Up. D, left, jump, right, A, down. Okay. That may have been wrong. Let's see. Up, D, right, jump. Oh, whoops. Jumped twice. I'm used to seeing the A button and thinking, oh, yeah, jump. All right. Up, D, right, jump, right, A, down. Okay, up A, jump, eh, down. Alright, I might have to come back to this. I may have the wrong code. 
Yeah, I should look at the Tetris no decoder and see if I got mine right. Fez Tetris. Code. Decoder. All right. All right, you can crack the Tetris code or the Tetra, the Tetra uh, Mino code by visiting a room with a large tablet that shows you the Tetra Mino block based on your movements, but the code is not easy to read. You, well, let's see on the purple tablets because to read the Tetramino code you must rotate the set of runes counterclockwise 90 degrees to the left reading the runes on their side is the key to cracking the code really I don't remember that so do I need to rotate those then Come on, this should be easier than that. Oh wait, some of those are sideways. But which orientation is it? Ah! This is frustrating. Last time I went into this room, I didn't solve it myself. I think I looked it up. I just so desperately want to solve it. You know? I wonder if all of those are oriented correctly on the wall. Okay, so that's step. Oh, dang it, I, I went away from my numbers. Oh, this is rough. So what if I put the numbers in the top left corners of each one of them? Will I get some duplicate numbers? You know, I've spent a lot of time here. I might just have to come back. That's frustrating. I feel like I was close, though. Oh, that's right. You could just shift through that. I thought that I just out of instinct I can go through it like that. Yeah, a treasure chest. Oh yeah, I left left control to open. For whatever reason, it's a different button. Yay, another key. I don't know what to do with that. Woo. Oh wait, there was a lot in that room. There's Mr. Rich Guy, and, and he has a fireplace, and that's a lot of people with fezes. That's a big owl. I remember there's a puzzle you're supposed to solve there, but I don't remember quite how. When, when you get to that owl. Because that's a thing you can find in the game, and it's really creepy. Anyways, I'm gonna... I'm gonna get out of there I'm going to climb down this and go visit the rest of the world 
Whoa! That was a cool sound. I love this game's sound design. It's so peaceful. I'm ready to begin my adventure, yes. Uh, this doesn't look like the inside of an island. Hey, listen! I know this is your first time outside of the village, so if you get lost, you can use the world map. Press escape to bring up the world map. Uh, uh. Oh. This is the world map. It shows you where you've been. So this is that room I was looking in. Does it show me the name of each room? You can zoom in and out using S and W. Okay. Oh! Hey! Nice! Rotate with A and D. Oh my goodness! Forgot you could rotate the map like this. There I am down... Here... I'm gonna go in there. I think all the golden ones are ones I've completely solved, which is very useful to know, and I appreciate it. Oh, I can zoom out really far. I don't remember exactly how big this map is. Okay, rotate with A and D. Each note represents a place in the world. A gold plating on a node means that I found every item, secret, or passage in that node. Yep, that's exactly what I was just saying. Look. Look? I, J, K... Oh! You, you could kind of do a mini rotate with this keypad over here. I... That's one they don't use very often. Oh, whoops. I, I overloaded it for a second there. Back, left, shift. I like that map. Very intuitive. Yeah, I'm gonna skip climbing over that. Vines are kind of tedious. IMO. This is fun. Whoa! I wonder if I couldn't solve that puzzle yet, just because the game didn't want me to solve it yet. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! Okay, that's right, I got, like, infinite lives. Hey! This is probably a bad spot for that to complete. Let me keep pressing the... <laughs> I probably could have fallen off. Uh-oh! I did! Oh, I'm fine. I'm fine. That's a cool door sound. Whoa! Check this place out. Yeah, this is really neat. Feels pretty important, eh? Let's have a look around, shall we? Oh, no way. It's another room door. Told you there would be a lot of doors. This one requires four cubes. This one, eight. And this one, sixteen. This place, it's like some kind of important door place. Uh, I, I, uh, I don't know. That's why you're here. Go find them cubes. Alright. Oh, hey, that's the map of the town! Do the other ones have maps above them? They do. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's so cool. I love that. They light up as I have each one. Each one has a map. Uh-oh. Probably don't want to be behind it for too long. Okay. What's over here? Oh, and one more thing. Press tab, you'll bring up the inventory. The inventory keeps track of things I find. Okay, he's done. He swears. Swearing's bad. Cube shards. Two. Two out of all of them. Artifacts. Treasure maps. Can 
Can I, can I select it? Oh, I select it with space. And, and back is shift. Oh, that's only part of it. Because that's the number two? That should be... Where I put my phone? I need a screenshot. The, the number system. That is the number two, yes. I was correct. Or maybe I'm missing a step zero on that code. That I didn't quite realize was a step. I mean, it makes sense if this is if this was binary. I can make a binary sequence detector if I really wanted to out of, you know, uh, wh whatever gates I need. Oh, there's a door up here. What is this? A cutscene? Oh, it was just loading. That was a loading screen. Oh, my goodness. Gee, I really forgot just how amazing this game is. Can I get up there? Probably don't want to be in the water too long. There we go. Uh oh. All right. Oh, this game's just so pretty and fun. I want to get all the cubes. I want to go into that tree after I get all the cubes. Ah! That's right. Fall damage. Oh, that says something. On each side. I don't remember that being important. I want to go into that tree. That's the very first thing I want to do. What's in that tree? Another tree. Whoops, I missed. Oh, there's another way up. And then here. Aha! Is that a door down there? But, dang it, I just made this really cool jump. background of this is really cool too oh could have just done that my jump's been invalidated all right going through this door ooh this is all pretty neat Okay, that's how I get closer. Ugh. Do I have a key? I have a key. I can go into that door. I'm gonna get so lost so fast. But that's okay, because I got a map. <laughs> uh oh. Is it closer this way? Yes. I love how everything just acts and interacts in this game. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ah! I wasn't ready. Treasure chest up there! Ah! Ah! <laughs> this is spooky! 
I wasn't ready for that! Alright, left control to interact with the chest. Yeah, I made it up here! Another part of the map! What step is it? You know, the first time I did this, I also didn't understand how to in to interact with the map. I didn't know what the numbers were. This time I picked up on the numbers. Oh, you can rotate these. So this is step two. And what is that, step three? Okay, yeah, that's step three. Interesting. Water tastes so good. Hydrate or dihydrate. Alright, now I have to go back down the way I came. Probably less scary this time, though. Because I'm going down. No, this is still just as scary. Ah! Ah! Don't kill me, don't- Ah! Yep. Exactly as scary as it was before. Jump down from there! Ha ha! I made it! <laughs> that was very spook. Oh wait, did I... Finish that room? Oh, I did! Oh, there's another, like, little room off of this? Oh, that's not the way back up. This is. Man, I suck at this game. Good thing I've got, like, infinite lives. Alright, is this the other room that goes off of it? I think so. Okay. Wait. So this room's completed, but there's another way through? I wonder if I just... The fuck? Well, I did it! I made it here! Very spook! Can I leave now? Okay, I got a thing. Well, I can go somewhere else from here, which is probably... Oh, hey! I wanna... I don't know, climb around down here and see. There's something down here. Okay, there wasn't. I didn't kill myself. Ah! 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 It's a very small platform. Very spook. All right, it's loading some more. Okay. It would appear I've made it to the spookiest part of the game. This is a freaking graveyard village. I'm gonna collect those cubes. I made it here by accident. Oh, there's little things I have to jump on. Hey, this looks a lot like... Oh. The, the maps I have. But not quite. Okay, what's over here? Uh-oh, spaghetti. Why is it moving me so slowly over here? Oh. That's why.
Oh, do they have to make it so spooky? It's making my skin crawl. I think if I go fast enough, I can catch him off guard? No, he just always stares at me. If I remember correctly, there's a door in his head. But you gotta get him to not look at you anymore. Which I've done before. Wait, can I talk to him? Yeah, that owl creeps me out a lot, too. It stares at me no matter which direction I- and it's staring directly at me! Can I go anywhere from here? Yeah, there- There's a door in the back of the owl's head, but I don't know how to get- in there. I have to come back to this. Maybe there's a Tetris code around here somewhere? I don't see anything. I'm, I'm gonna not stick around this place anymore. This is giving me the willies. It's giving me the willies something fierce. Uh-oh. Gotta get better at jumping. All right. <sighs> very atmospheric, but very willies inducing. Completed a cube in Spooky Land. I got three. <laughs> three out of the four for that one door. Okay. Oh, each one of these trees is a different size. If I jump on the trees, I can get up higher. Oh! And there's these little platforms around. Evidence of a platform exists. Is there one I'm close enough to to jump to? Oh. Okay, I have to do it from here. What is that? Is that crow just teabagging over here? What's he doing? Alright. Ah! I guess that's what crows do is they teabag. Well, that one's not as severe as the other one was. This music is very... I don't know, I feel cool. This music's making me feel cool. Oh, there's a skull up here. How, how nice. It takes me to an even bigger skull. I'm gonna go this way, because this, this place was the hardest to get to. Alright. Let's, let's collect more small cubes. Fuck that! Oh, fuck this! Is that a door in the back of his head? I think it is. I just don't know how to stop him. Ah, shoot! Can I jump in his eye? Oh. Don't look at me like that. You weren't supposed to look at me. Huh, each one of those skulls is looking a different direction. That's supposed to mean something? Is the gravestone here a clue? The fuck did I just see? 
th th there, there was something. There's a ghost up here. Okay. Ah! <laughs> Don't do that. Afterlife, what? Outer space. After space. Outer life. Give me a second. Oh, <laughs> it keeps spooking me out. I, I'm getting out of here. I'm, I'm, I'm leaving this section. You know what? But that was probably important. I should probably write it down. All right. All right. I think I need to go here. Nope, nope, I went the wrong way. Mm. That's spooky. <sighs> this place is gonna give me a heart attack, I swear. At least it's not the nether. Hey, ghost guy. Can you say that for me again so I can write it down? Thank you. Arigato. After life. Outer space. When he's tangible like this, it's less scary. But like, just his figure appearing in the lightning is so spooky. I, th I think I'm, I'm I think I'm getting better with him. After space, outer life. I'm writing that all down just in in case. Ghost says. I'm gonna underline that. Go, what, what the ghost says is very spook. Don't want to be here anymore. Stop looking at me, you terrifying skull. Does that skull look at me too? I mean, I, I don't think it did, but okay, it doesn't. <sighs> oh. Don't do this to me. I don't remember this place being this spooky. You just gotta look for evidences of platforms. Oh, I missed a cube. Alright, I'm gonna get that cube. Oh, and one here too. Oh, hey, I completed another one. You wanna see me play a real horror game? <laughs> oh, that went so well, I played Phasmophobia. And, oh my gosh, all I could do was hide. What, what, once I, once I realized that ghosts were very spooky? Yeah, I, I am, I'm a bit, bit I, I'm a bit of a wuss when it comes to things like that. That's why I don't like watch any scary movies. Is because I know how I react to these things. <laughs> yeah, I also plan on playing Slenderman in the eight pages. Not, not the eight pages, uh, Slenderman Arrival. I've got it for the Xbox One. So you'll, you'll see me play that eventually. I doubt very much that I'm gonna finish it. Alright. There's a room I haven't been in yet. Oh. <sighs>
Why did they put this in the game? Like, the music here is really cool and all, but... <laughs> Stop it. Oh, hey, I could go that way. I'm gonna hold off on going that way. Alright, how do I go up? Where did I come in at? Alright, maybe I start here. Go here. Jump here. Okay, there's that door again. Now, jump across the trees. Very expertly. I'm, I'm a master platformer. As you've- Ah! As you can clearly tell there. Alright, and I saw platforms. I just gotta get closer to them. Oh! Oh, there we go. Those platforms are a lot better here. Ugh. Okay. Oh, and there's a room over there. <gasps> Another piece of the map! What step is that? If I remember correctly, that's step one. Outlast. I think I've heard of it. Yeah, that's step one. So I've got steps one, two, and three. All right. Where does this take me? Does this... This only takes me... Okay. Okay. So this room takes me nowhere. Oh. It's not a browser game. Shut up! This game's awesome. I love it. Except for right now it's really spooky and I hate it. Alright. I think that's all I need to collect. And then I've got this room. Map. Yep. Alright. Now go back to where I came. That lightning struck real close. Okay, I can go other places. I don't even... I'm not even sure if I want to look at Outlast. Ah, there's a ghost! Don't believe the hypercube. Should I read it spookier? Don't believe the hypercube! Maybe what the ghosts say is nonsense, but they still freak me the fuck out. Ah! It's just... I I don't know if I have the heart to play these games. The, 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 the spooky games. Alright, I'm gonna go over there. <sighs> don't trust the hypercube, huh? Is that why this place has become so spooky? Hypercube do this to y'all? Okay. That's an ominous looking tower. I'll wait to go there. Whoops. Come on, get up. Is that another one complete? Hey, five cubes. I didn't expect to get to such a spooky place so fast. What is that, a bomb? Ow. 
What's that over there? Can I pick that up? I don't remember... <sighs> if I can just get up there... Alright, alright, I gotta get m more of a running start. I have a bomb. Oh shoot, oh shoot! Interesting. Oh, I can throw it. I thought I had to set it down. Dang it, it wasn't close enough. Uh oh. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, there's two? Ah! You know what? I'm just gonna hold it. I'm gonna be a suicide bomber. Oh, that brings me over here. That's how you get up. Okay. Okay. Map. I've not completed this area? What else is here? Is there... a Tetris code somewhere? There's two other places I can go? Oh. There's one. Oh, hey, a full cube. And a ghost. What, what do you have to say? Owls creep you out, but you forget why. Okay. Thanks, spooky ghost. Thanks for the tip. Yay! Cube! The what? Oh, it takes me back to the closest warp gate. Okay, I've been to one of those. I'm, I, I don't quite want to use that yet, though. Oh, that's what that sound is. Let's see how many times I can make it. <laughs> the sound, I mean. Oh, it's closed off again. Alright. Where else was I able to- Oh, over there. I can go over there. Here's one little cube. A cube bit. There's another one. No, I didn't want to climb on the vine. Oh, another full cube. Alright. Yay! And another warp gate. Those things are so creepy here. But I need to go back here. And go this way. So I'm not going to use the warp gate. Just going to climb. Oh! That's probably the bottom. There we go. There we go. Alright, now I gotta go back 
to where I came from. I like how you can see where you're going in the background. Oh! I have the key I need for that. Alright. Please don't be really creepy. Please, please, please don't be... Oh, I thought I had a key for this. I don't. So I should have just warped back to there. Oh, well, it's too late now. Oh, there's writing there. It probably says, here lies Jeff. Yeah, I could have just warped back here and it would have been eh, a bit eh, decently faster. Alright. Oh, I might be done with this area with what I can do so far. Because I can't... I, I don't know how to get that door. And I don't... Come on, up, up a bit. Know how to get that door. So that's going to stay a question. So I'm going to warp back to where I know. I'm, I'm getting the fuck out of here. Very spooky. Oh, my foot. Oh, what would I do? That was weird. Behold. The warp gate. Pick a destination and press up to warp. Did I go everywhere I could in the tree? I, I did. Actually, I didn't. I didn't go up. I want to keep exploring the tree. Oh, yep, 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 yep. Hey, look at that cute little bird. Alright, now I go here. See, this is a neat little forest. Good change of pace from the, the graveyard. <laughs> Never, hopefully. Don't even know what Outlast is, or I'm unclear on what it is. There we go, I knew there was an easier way up. <laughs> Outlast when? <laughs> Please, no. You saw how- this isn't even a horror game and I was freaked the fuck out. How about today? How about no? <laughs> No, thank you. I, I don't even own Outlast. Or, or have money. If it's a game I have to buy. You know what? I'm never buying that game on my own volition. How about that? Oh, hey. Neat little door. Buy one. 
the chest. How do I get up there? Should I start deciphering this? That chest just right there. <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> oh, jeez. That last sounds scary. I'm gonna have to ignore that chest for now, because I don't know how to get up there. Even though I know there's probably a key in there. Hey, it's another one of those symbols. Oh no. Oh, whoops. That that brought me out a lot farther than I thought it would. Okay. Oh. Sometimes this the the 3D doesn't quite work the way you want it to. Hey, those are lovely pink trees. I can go up higher. Amnesia. <laughs> I don't want to become a spooky game. I don't want to become a spooky game player. Oh my goodness. Maybe one every once in a while, but... <laughs> I wasn't even able to beat Slenderman Arrival. I got into, like, the mines, and I noped the fuck out of there. Alright. Door. Oh, this is neat. <laughs> yeah. They would be priceless, but I don't want to. <laughs> I've almost got another cube. Oh, I didn't make it. I could have, though. There we go. <sighs> oh, hey! I found a new area. Unlocked the new port part part of the warp gate. Whoa. This is some sort of ancient city. What's down here? Another door. I'm gonna go through it. Just for fun. Like, oh, oh, hold on. Time switch. Switches can be wound up. Grab the handle with left control and rotate with DA until it's wound up. Then let's have a go at it. But hurry up, because it winds back down. Or before it winds back down. Okay. Oh! Oh, that's a cool sound. Uh-oh! Oh, I didn't need to go through that. Okay. I can do this better this time. Look at that. I could have just done this. Now what? Oh. Does that flip over too? Oh, it flips over also. Oh, I made it to the next time switch. Uh-oh. Ah! 
Dang it, I wanted to take a shortcut. Yeah, I know what time switches do. Shut up. Okay, where to go from up here? Ah! I don't know! I think I know. Maybe. Yeah, shut up. I'm pressing the wrong button. I like the music it plays. There we go. I made it. Oh, hey. Another cube. Another full cube. There we go. Hey, I got it. Oh, I found eight cubes. I don't want to go back to the place with all the doors. Shut up, you can't make me. I'm doing this now. <gasps> oh, this is the observatory. There's something neat you can unlock here if you know binary code well enough. Wait, hold on, hold on. It's a big telescope. Press left control on either handle to spin the telescope one way or the other. You can look into this telescope by pressing left control near the eyepiece. Nothing. It's probably too early in the day though. Nothing. <laughs> There's nothing. This is probably just too early in the day. wait around here until night. I also don't want to look up the solution. Alright, I guess I'll leave it be for now. Alright. There's another place I can go? Another door? Is it this? It worked this time. Black holes are bad. Without the hexahedron, the world is going unstable. Space can only be folded so many times before it rips. Was that where I was supposed to go? I don't think so. Can I go back? Oh, I can go back. Oh, they're like little shortcuts. I guess I'll just have to do it next time I come back here. Because I just found another door, which is really neat. Look at that bird freaking out. It's gone now, but... Was... I'll go into that door. Ooh. 
What? Does it mean? Am I supposed to arrange the cubes in a certain way? Oh, I can pick them up. And throw them too. Maybe I'm supposed to arrange the cubes like that? Don't know how I can do the first one. So I've got to be able to stack them. But at the very least, I can do the one to the right. Oh, and they go into their places. I think I'm going to do the one below the first one. Well, that's not how it's supposed to work, but it works. Come on. No, I don't want to go behind it. Looks like I have to go around. Now I just got to push it. Okay, that's this. I've arranged it into one of them. Now what? That's a bit frustrating. Maybe there's like a map or something that I need. Or does it need to be those from each direction? I mean, they only line up in, a, in one direction. I'm going to leave this be for now. Yeah, I'm going to go back. So I just started out over here. Oh, that's right. I have to do this over here. And then I can go here. Climb up. There we go. He's just having a bit of trouble. A QR code. I wonder if I can scan it with my phone. Will my phone recognize it? Alright. Camera app. Come on, recognize the QR code. I think it's supposed to be a puzzle hint, but it's not scanning it. Oh! 
Tap here to see the text and notes. Contents. It says left, right trigger, right trigger, left trigger, right trigger. All right. Right, right, left, right, left, 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 right. Oh my goodness! Hey! It worked! I found my first anti-cube. For every cube, there's an anti-cube. Negative for every positive. Anti-cubes are much harder to find than regular cubes. Oh! <gasps> anti-cubes! I was wondering why this was just empty. Okay. Well, that's neat. You know, to be honest, I forgot about anti-cubes. Oh, my dog's starting to bark in the next room. Uh-oh. Oh, gosh. Those things are evil. Oh, okay, that's how I can get up there. What's over here? That looks like a big fancy building. I want to go over there. I need to up. Oh! Wait, I think I know what to do. If I can stop falling off the edge. All right. Wow, he really bounced me up. I was able to pretty much skip everything. Hey, there's a bird hanging out on that tree. Woo! Oh, hey, a last cube! Oh, it's waiting for me to be on stable ground. That's some neat problem solving there. Alright, what's in here? Oh, another fireplace. Can I take a bookshelf out? That's what that picture says right there. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. I'm not trying to suicide, but it's happening. I could push it. That's a globe. Can I turn the go? Oh, I can turn the globe. And there's a door on it. Looks like he wants to say something. Check this out. I bet you can rotate this giant globe just like a pivot. I, I, I accidentally pressed the wrong button. Come on. No, shut up. Okay, but there's a cube in there. Oh! I rotate it that far, get the cube, and then go through the door. Can I not go through the door? I can't go through the door. I've got to be able to. 
Maybe if I do it the other way. On the other side. No, wrong button. Sorry, Dot. Didn't mean to talk to you. Nothing against you. It's just... Shut up. Oh, there we go. Now it's a door. Kind of glitched out, but like... <gasps> a chest! What's in the chest? What's in the chest? What's in the chest? Come on. Show me. Show me. Show me. Show me. Show me. Show me. <gasps> the fuck is that? An ancient artifact. Looks like a book. Yep, it's a book. Can I read the book? What do I do with this? That's pretty neat. It's a big book. Can't really do anything with it, though. It's kind of disappointing. Guess I can't yet do anything with it, but I might find a use for it. Okay, I completed that. Isn't this music just awesome? Freaking love it. All right, now to go through there. Why can't I go through the fireplace? Oh, you can't go through the fireplace. Just looks like a place you're supposed to be able to go. Oh well, I found what I was looking for, I guess. I've completed this too, so I can just go back. Is there a safe way down? Okay, that wasn't too high. Ah! Ah! All right. <gasps> the clock! Oh, I remember solving that puzzle. The cl that clock there is a puzzle. And I suicide off the edge again. Oh, come on. Ah, what? I love the music, the, the little time gate plays. Oh, that also moves depending on- oh, it just always moves. Is there anything on this island here? Oh my gosh, the clock's playing a little beat. I love this. Can I write this? Oh, I can! I think if you can get those all to line up, you get an anti-cube. Oh! You get an anti-cube for each one you get to go... ...to its thing. Do I know what time it is? <laughs> Cube o'clock. Thanks. You're not gonna own up to your joke? Okay, so when that thing goes back to the top, I can get this cube over here. 
What does this do? I know what a time switch does. Shut up, Dot. Oh! Uh-oh, I'm about to miss it. Come on, come on, come on. Hurry up, hurry up. I want to get the cube. I want to get the cube. Oh, I missed it. Ah, uh, uh, shoot. Because I'm just here for another minute. Say as I suicide off the edge. Again. How do I get down from here? Oh, there we go. I'm just jamming out to the noises the clock's making. Uh-oh. The thing down there's kind of broken, ain't it? Alright, it's almost time. I've got like 15 seconds left. Yeah, that little vine thing broke. Gimme, 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 gimme! I got one of them! Oh! That one disappeared forever. Did any of them move faster now? Blue one's so far away. They're all very far away, but... I'm gonna guess one of these is weeks, one of these is days, and one of these is hours. So I'll have to come back here sometime in the future. Um, did I miss anything off this path? No, I probably just want to take the portal back here. There's another room? That's right, I couldn't find it. might take a bit before I decide to actually go find it. Alright, well, I'm going to do this again. There we go. Alright. Uh-oh! Come on. Yeah. Ah! I almost didn't make it. Going back to the portal. Maybe I should go back to the door room like I like he said I should. I don't explore this whole place yet. I guess it's easy enough to get back here. Alright. I'm gonna go back over here. That's freaking neat. All right. He wanted me to go back to the door room. I wanted him to fuck the, the, the fuck right off. But I guess he's right. So I have enough to open this one. But he wanted me to go through this one. I had eight. Might as well go through that one. Oh my goodness. Those are neon lights. Wait, is that a key to the owl puzzle? I can't jump on the trash cans. Uh, there's the owl! What's 
what's in here? Oh, just a cube. Is this a shower? I want to translate that. Oh, hey, another boiler room. Oh, and it's already completed. There's nothing in here. I'm going to regret saying that down the line. I'm pretty sure. Why does it become daytime every once in a while? Or just not raining? It's a neat aesthetic, but... Huh. Alright, a letter key. Alright, that first one... Is a W, because you read it top to bottom, right to left. W. A. Is that going to say want? Alright. That is not an N. Wa. W A T. C. Watch? Is that going to say watch? H, yeah, watch. Alright. That's not Y, so it does, it's not like watch your back or nothing. Uh, what's, what's that next letter? Oh. Watch out. Oh, it's going to say watch out for. Let's see. Yep, watch out. And then the next one's going to probably be, yep, for, is that going to say owls? Watch out for H, O, A, L, is that going to say holes? Yep, it says holes. Watch out for holes. Is that relevant? I wonder if these neon lights say anything important. Alright, it's probably going to take me a minute. Watch out for holes. There's a lot of neon lights here. Alright, but I don't know which order to read them in. I'll probably decipher that and each one's got four sides oh but it only says two things okay all right that one square up in the corner there w O R work work C H A work H A R Work hard. So that's what the neon light next to the owl says. What does this one here say? I'm going to start on this side. Alright. Uh, G... O O. Is that going to say good luck? Uh, 
No, it's not going to say good luck. Good. Oh, good food. Do these not even say anything useful? I'm deciphering this, but, like, it's not saying anything. Alright, what's that small one? I kind of want to decipher that small one, too. E. Oh, that's going to see say eat here. Or something. Eat. Yep, that's E-A-T. M. E. Oh, that meat? Eat meat? Yep, that says eat meat. I'm not too worried about the two character one. Uh, might as well. No. Does that say no? That's NU. Or NV. NU. E. New -u? The what? Okay, none of this is important. I just wasted several minutes of, of time on this. But the owl's right there! And none of it meant anything. It's a fair bit disappointing. Tetris code. Alright. This one's already deciphered for me. That one's used up. Alright, the first one's up. Left. Right. Jump. Up, left, a shift right, which is D. Jump, yeah, it seems like each one's got eight. And I was missing one. In the other room there. But does it start on zero or end on eight is my question. Right, jump. A. And then. Right. Jump again. Down. I want one of these to work. All right. Hey! Hey! Look at that! I did it! I deciphered something! There we go. It was not all for naught. Hey look, Q-Birth Theory. Did I complete that room? I did. Alright, the next room I gotta go up here for. Hello? Anything in here? Anything to decipher? Nope. Did everything there was to do.
This just got a dinky little bit in here. Anything in here? No, that was all of it. So this this place doesn't lead off anywhere. Alright. I thought this, those were going to take me... Th those doors were going to take me to much more exciting places. I mean, this place is pretty exciting. I, I solved a, a thing here. But, you know. Oh, I almost have enough for that. Alright. Let's go in here. Haven't done that yet. Oh, th well, well, this is a nice place. Oh my gosh, it's a city. These people worshipped Owl. Oh, and I can't shift in here. It's two-dimensional. So these people lived in the second dimension and only the second dimension. Come on, I've got to be able to shift. Alright, these people hunted beasts and cooked beasts. And, okay. I guess I just get to get to figure out what these people were about. Just like little cavemen, I guess. Okay. Learn nothing new here. So I guess these people were like little simpletons. Alright. They had a cauldron. I still can't shift. Can I go into the cauldron? I sure I remember being able to do something with the cauldron. Control does nothing. Okay. That's fine. Oh, that's a black hole. Uh, watch what happens when I jump in. So this room's off limits for now. I bet you there's something in there if I go in there at the right time. Now's not the time. All right, I completed both of those areas. That wasn't supposed to happen. Well, I can just climb down from here. That's everything I could do here. able to get enough? No, I need three more. Alright. Going back here. Because I haven't actually explored this area. I've, I've taken this area. Uh-oh. But there's ways around those, so it's not too big of a problem. I'm just going to go through here. Avoid those black holes. 
Oh, if I remember correctly, I can adjust sea level. I just don't remember how. Dang it, I have to walk all the way over here. That bird is just freaking out on that. Huh. Oh, I don't have a key. I need more keys. Go into cool places like this. Hey! I just need two more cubes. How do I get up there? Do I raise the sea level? Oh, I maybe I can climb up higher? Oh, come on, I've got to be able to get up there. I just can't jump high enough. Alright, I'm gonna give it one more try and then I'm moving on. Do I need to be running fast? Alright, moving on. I just have to come back here sometime. Black hole's gone? No, they're still here. That doesn't really change things much. Just gotta be careful where I shift. Oh, wait. Oh! Look, a Tetris code! Alright, I don't need to get any closer to that. I just need to look at it sideways. Alright, so you start by going left. And then shift left. And shift right. Then up, jump, then down, D, which is right shift, right shift. Left, A, right, up, jump, down, D, D. Do I need to be closer to it to, for it to work? Let's... Left, left shift, right... Oh, I think I deciphered one of these wrong. Oh, did I skip? I think I skipped some instructions. Or is that different than the one I'm, I looked at before? No, it's the same on each side. Okay. Left, A, right. And I said up for some reason. When there is between the up... A shift right. Is this longer than I'm used to? Up, jump, down, D, D. 
This one has nine steps. All right. Left A, right D, jump down D, D. Oh! There's an owl here. Many are one. The one is many. Oh, you have to find the owls! That's how you get it to stop! That's how you get that owl over there to stop. You find the owls! There's four owls. One in each place. Oh! I did solve it! Is that it? What's this door? Oh, that's another code. Alright, I'm gonna try solving this one. Even though the last one didn't go as well as I thought it would. Okay, that's... Did I shift it to the, the right way? Shift it 90 degrees left, right? Maybe I did it backwards. Fez, touch, code. Yeah, I'm doing it right. Oh, where did that go? Damn it, I looked away for too long. Alright, I'm gonna keep trying at this one. Okay, so that's left. Left, A, right, D, up. Jump down, D, D. Left, A, right, D. Jump down, D, D. Oh! Maybe I had to do it during the daytime? Oh, this lower sea level. It's a valve. Valves can control the water level. Grab onto it with left control, then rotate left or right. Okay, that raises it. There are only positives from this. Chest! Tell me you got a key. Come on, come on, come on. I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. Come on! Oh. Burnt map, huh? I remember that. No one's ever found the other half of that map. What they did for that is they got together, the whole Fez community, and solved the other half of it by, by just inputting random sequences. I have to start in the center there. But I have to find that room. Did I complete that? I did. Alright. I want to go inside that other room. But I think that only shows itself at night. So I'll have to wait. get up higher. 
Oh. All right. Sacrifice! All right. I'll have to come back at night. Solving some neat puzzles. Can I push those? No, those are pretty much stationary. Ooh, I need a bomb. I want another one. No. Oh, big door. Oh, I remember this one. There we go. This is like only the one of the coolest moments in the entire series. The entire game. What am I saying series for? There we go. That neat look at all that one bomb did that I would have done that better it would have been cooler ah no, I stopped it. Stopped at the wrong time. Oh, it's it's 2.13. Looks like I have time to solve this room. And I probably should get off. Oh, wow, that was pretty cool. Oh, it gives you a little checkpoint that I didn't need. Sure hope it doesn't want me to use. Yeah, I don't think it needs me to use the bomb. Why'd I fall off? There we go. There we go! So that's the mines. Where's that other door? There's supposed to be somewhere else I can go. Is there something I'm supposed to be able to do with that bomb? There's another door around here. Oh! Found it. I think that worked for what I needed it for. It didn't. You know, I'm gonna grab the other bomb. You know, the bomb that 
belongs over here. Oh, come on, come on, come on! There we go! Alright. I should probably call it here. Wait. Oh, there... That's probably where it is. Alright, alright. I'm getting too into this. It's time to end the stream. It's been two, two hours and 15 minutes. Uh, I think that was a lot of fun. I, I really like this game. I, I solved a few puzzles. Uh, it did a few neat things. See, I, I think I think everyone should have this game. It's it's awesome. Um, it just came out on the Switch, which is the reason why I figured I could pick it back up. It's because it's relevant again. A little bit. But anyways, that, that's my soapbox about this game. I'll, I'll see you guys next time I stream, which I am not entirely certain when that's going to be. Could be tonight, maybe tomorrow. I, I don't know. All right. I'll see y'all.